Uh, my motorcycle's here. My motorcycle is here. Hey mate, how you doing? Hello, hello everyone. This is Nikhil Jade and it's been a while. Lockdown's been crazy and I sold my bike. Now that's a video for another video slot time. So I sold my Continental GT 535, the red one. Um, and I still have my bullet, my Royal Enfield bullet and um, my other DMW two-stroke Dolomite. So guys, I'm just waiting for my motorcycle now. I'm excited and it's getting picked up by a moving company. Uh, Auckland motor, like an affordable motorcycle movers, I believe, Andy. Um, um, good communication, I'll recommend these guys and I'll definitely use these guys again. He said about 200 k's or something, it's about know. 90 odd. Yeah, that's even better. 90 um, k's. It's about keys though, mate. Yeah, yeah. What a bike. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's this the last one they did with the Carburetta. Yeah. No ABS. Yeah, they, they change, I don't know what they, I don't, I think they're going to stop this, eh, this model. Yes, that's it, that's the last one of it. Mm. I, I think they did an ABS at the end of the day. So guys, um, just took my bike for a quick um, first ride, and yeah, so I went around to like a local reserve, and yeah, managed to get it quite dirty. Well, it's not that bad, but yeah, I mean, for a brand new bike, day one. Um, yeah, so I'm pretty, pretty stoked about it. So I've got to wash it. Need to get a bash plate here. So, so I've ordered some of these parts like that's gonna arrive soon. So yeah, beautiful, beautiful bike. Rides well. Feels good. It's kind of kind of weird to sit so high because um, last bike was a Cafe Racer Continental GT, and also got a Bullet and a DMW. So fairly high riding position. But yeah, it's fun. I can comfortably cruise. And overtake on the motorways if I want to now and yeah so let's uh, wash this bike grab this and this on the garden hoses so I think this is the first time ever that I've actually washed my bike after riding it once and I think I have to get used to this because if I want to make this my daily rider and also take it off-roading I need to wash it pretty much you know straight away so try ah. okay well I think this is gonna go There you go. Fantastic, so that's done. So guys, I'll have to take my pants off, but I've got I've got shorts on underneath, so don't worry. It's too hot. It's too cold and too hot. Now let's try to find my little 
I just wear my dress shoes. There's nothing, <laughs> nothing like washing your bike with your dress shoes on. And to be honest, um, if you look at my dress shoes, well, these are the old ones. So sometimes I ride, you know, I ride my bike with these on most of the times if I'm going out or something. But yeah, today it got a bit dirty, so yeah, these aren't these these aren't my main shoes. I'll show you my main dress shoes after. But yeah, so I suppose these are my dual purpose dress and riding shoes. Um, so yeah, let's start. So we've got this thing here. And hope, let's get started, let's wash the bike. So guys, um, she is nice and clean. Well, that's fine. <laughs> it just shows the bike. Dirty. But I think she's fine. Overall, she looks, apart from the tires, Everything's tidy, all that crap is out from here. So yeah, pretty stoked so far. Um, one of the things I'm gonna get is um, windshield or whatever, cause seats so high, heavy wind just, just hits you on the chest. So, need to get some, um, what do you call it, the micro cloth, microfiber or whatever. So yeah, I'm going to go for another ride um, in about next two hours. I'm going to have a workout now. So I'm going to do my jump ropes, some weights, and yeah. See what happens next. Yeah. 